All right, welcome back to the next lesson in the Next Gen Garage series. Today we're going to be working with the front and at roll bar section, or basically this section up here. The front and I roll bars are kind of an adjustment that's used to kind of fine tune the suspension, where a spring change would be too much of a change. So what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to show you what the difference is between the uh, different settings are. It looks like we only got two options. We got one, th one three eighths bar and a two inch bar. So according to iRacing here, the larger the anti-roll bar means it's a stiffer bar and it's going to make the car tighter. So what we'll do is we'll start off with the uh, with a one, one and three eighths bar, which should make the car turn more and we'll go out and see what that actually drives like. Okay, it seems to have pretty good turn in here. And we're gonna go ahead and put the thicker bar in. And we'll see how that affects the handling. This should tighten the car up. So it should have less turn in than the uh, the previous run here. So let's go out and run it. This would be kind of like putting a slightly stiffer spring in the front end of the car. So it should tighten me up. feeling it doesn't feel like it wants to turn in quite as well but basically the sway bar is going to pretty much affect the uh, affect the car from the entrance of the corner to about the middle of the corner once you get past the middle of the corner and towards the corner exit the sway bar has less effect let's go ahead and pop back out of here
still not popped out of there yet. There we go. We'll go back to the garage. So basically that's the difference between the thinner bar and the thicker bar. The thinner bar makes the car turn in a little bit more. It gives you a little bit more steering, particularly on entry. Where a stiffer sway bar is going to make the car a little bit less responsive coming into the corner. You might have to turn the wheel a little bit more to get it to turn. And it might and it's gonna increase the wear on the right front tires just slightly over what the thinner bar will. And with that, that concludes the uh, lesson on the front AI front anti-roll bar diameter lesson. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.